Jean, thank you. A major break tonight in the Morgan Harrington case. Police say they can tie the abduction and murder of the Virginia Tech student to a sexual assault in Fairfax City. There is even a police sketch of a suspect. Rachel DePompa joins us with this developing story. Well, this is the man police are looking for. Investigators will only say that forensic evidence ties him to Morgan Harrington's abduction and murder in Charlottesville. But Harrington's parents confirmed this afternoon it was DNA found on Morgan that matches the suspect in the Fairfax case. The night she vanished outside a Metallica concert at the John Paul Jones Arena in Charlottesville, 20-year-old Morgan Harrington came into contact with this man. A suspect in the 2005 abduction and sexual assault of a woman in Fairfax City. There's a definite forensic link between Morgan Harrington and the case in uh, Fairfax City from 2005. In September of 2005, a 26-year-old walking home from the grocery store on Rock Garden Drive was grabbed from behind and carried to a park. She was physically and sexually assaulted. The man in this police sketch was never caught. At that time, he apparently had a beard. And, of course, hairstyles and facial hair can change over time, and people can change over time, especially over a five-year period. Morgan Harrington's parents have known about the link between the cases for weeks. I feel like it's a, a real positive step, you know, towards us being able to find uh, justice for Morgan. Investigators say as soon as they found the match, they began going over surveillance video from the John Paul Jones Arena and nearby stores and banks. Still, we have... We don't have anyone fitting his description, even an altered description, in any of that video. And uh, you know, we still have no pictures of her in any of the, the video there at the arena. Morgan's parents say this new development has brought out new emotions. To Dan and Jill, their daughter's killer now has a face. Prior to this, the murder was an abstraction that killed our daughter. There's now a face. I've been making blanket statements of be careful, and now we can say be careful of this guy. There's a $150,000 reward for information leading to the arrest and conviction of Morgan's killer. If you have any information about the man in this sketch, call State Police. That number is 434-352-3467. Rachel DePompa, NBC12 News. Thank you, Rachel. Well, 65 is a thing of the past on a local highway. A new law now allows you to drive a little.